Hey, whoa. Sorry. It's Paul. Today I'm going to talk about my variegated sky flower, or my Duranta erecta variegata. Now look at the leaves here, because that's what it looked like for eight years. And then it's crazy. I just noticed today that they're not variegated this year. So maybe they're going to come back, but I've never noticed that before. They've always been variegated as I purchased it at Home Depot. Again, not too long ago, a few years ago. So that's crazy. What happened? Where did my variegated leaves go? Sometimes plants will just stop being variegated. Huh, this information is accurate. Go pause it if you want, but let's talk about it my way. So I love this thing. I call it the um, variegated sky flower again. Some people call it a golden dew drop. But it's really grown for its summer flowers and its contrasting orange and kind of yellow fruit that it produces. These uh, Don't eat them though, they're toxic. And this plant likes fold apart sun in Southern California and it will grow. Some people call it a tree or I call it it's a shrub tree to me, but it will grow 25 feet tall and in wide. And it's known for this really beautiful cascading cluster of these blue kind of tubular flowers here and you can see I love the texture of them it's just amazing I, I don't know something about them I just really think is so special and unique to have in the garden I think you can see why Ooh, wow all right so anyways um, its leaves should be creamy and yellow with kind of they had yellow margins on the outer they were just kind of variegated on the outer edge but now you can see right now they're all every single leaf on the whole plant is this color green they are slightly serrated the leaves let's see if we could find some most of these are all fresh it kind of will drop them that's why i think it, the variegation will come back but it'll kind of drop them um, in southern california in about february march and then it'll just slowly grow them in and focus on this huge cluster of flowers here so again, I'm like <clears throat> about eight, eight to nine feet up, and you can see they do cascade over you. So let me get under it and show you that angle. This is what you see above you. At about seven feet up, it cascades over you. So we walk over this, our little backyard walkway. So that's pretty cool. Now this plant does like loamy soil, likes to be a bit moist, and it enjoys to be watered deeply. However, it's Pretty forgiving in part sun that's where we grow it and I only give it a few drippers I think it has two it's native to the West Indies and hardy to about 20 degrees now here is a better view even though it's not variegated which is crazy but here's those serrated leaves so there you go it's one of my favorite things about it the leaf structure so I hope I hope it gets variegated again Maybe it's going to come later, and I've just never noticed. That's very strange. All right. The sky flower. Is it variegated? I don't know. But Duranta erecta. And it was erecta variegata. But now it's just erecta. All right. There you go. Give us a like and a subscribe. Have a wonderful day. Take care.